So I want to talk about an icon, a living at the moment, living icon of Russia. Her name is Babushka Z. She's a gentle old lady who thought that she was greeting uh, Russian soldiers. Come to find out she was greeting evil Ukraine Nazi soldiers. And um, something bad has happened. And I want to talk about it because I also want to talk about the manipulation of people saying that this isn't her. So, but I, but in order to get you guys up to date on what's happening, I got to show you the full context so that you can be up to date on what's really going on uh, with this story. So there's a video and this one has subtitles to it because the video that was going around, they did not do a subtitle to it. I have to say this to those of you in Russia, and I don't mean to be a typical American, the reason why a lot of the news are not going out when you have videos is because you got to put subtitles on it. And I'm, t I'm speaking as a lazy American. If you put a video up and we don't know what is being said because we don't speak Russian, and that goes for any language, uh, Slovakian, Ukrainian, German, France, whatever. Um, if we don't know what's being said without any subtitles, we lose interest. Now, um, when I saw the video for the first time, it didn't have subtitles in it. And I had somebody just basically translate it for me because I wanted to know what was being said. So here's this. So let me tell you what, who there's three Ukrainian Nazi soldiers who are given food to people in, I think it's Kharkov. Okay. Um, uh, from my understanding is 20 miles away from the Russian bo uh, border. Now watch this video and I'm going to stop and start it so I can give you guys full context. This is her husband. Her husband knows that these are Rush these are Ukrainian soldiers because he's close up to them. He sees the arm patch. He sees the blue over yellow. Okay. So he knows that, uh oh, these are uh Ukrainian soldiers and they're taunting him by saying, can you say Slava Putin, Slava Russian forces? And they trying to make him say that and he's scared. So watch this. So he's like, no, I'm not going to say anything. And then he goes, but your wife just said it before. But his wife did not know that these were Ukrainian uh, Nazis, right? So that's what's happening right now. They're trying to get him to say this. And he's like, and, the old, old, and her husband knows what's going on. They know what's happening. They're like, he's like, no, I'm not going to say that. Because he don't know if they're going to shoot him on the spot or take them hostage. Чу, та ви ж тільки що ваша жена говорила. А? Жена ж говорила, говорю, що де там вона? О, о, о. О, о, зустрічає бабушка. So now here comes the uh his wife, the elder grandlady, uh the grandma. Uh and they call you can hear him say babushka. He says, "There she is with a red flag." Grandma is greeting Russian forces very nice. So he, because she doesn't see that these are Ukrainian forces, he's pretending to be Russian. All right. He's like, oh, there is Babushka greeting the Russian forces. Very nice. Roll out the banner, which is rolling out the flag that she has in her hand. So he's pretending to be a Russian soldier. Встречает бабушка. Видите, с красным флагом российские войска встречают. О, хорошо. А ну, разверните. There she is with a red flag. Grandma is greeting Russian forces. So she's, you know, she's coming out because she's happy. You know, says she's happy. She's Russian. And she's coming out and she's greeting what she thought was Russian soldiers. Вот эту тряпочку. Знамя, знамя разворачивайте, да, 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 да. Подходите, во, во, во. So he, so the Ukrainian Nazi is like, come closer. Where, where, were you waiting for us? And, and then she says, of course we were. We prayed for you and for Putin and for all our people. 
this is some evil shit right here, guys. I want you to understand. You got, but see, Nazis are that way. This is why you guys got to understand anybody who supports Ukrainians, knowing that these Nazi people are here, you have to understand that when you support Nazis, you are a piece of shit. We are Ждали, да? Ждали и молились за вас, и за Путина, и за весь народ. Угу, угу. Конечно. Снимай. Вот. Сейчас я вам же отблагодарю вот это. Let me reward you with what you just said. Here, are, here's some food. То, что вы ждали. Давай, отключим. So did you see the Ukrainian flag right there? Hold on, let me see if you see it. Right there. Um, and this same this symbol underneath there is this I dare. I think this is these are Nazis. These are legitimate Nazis. So you have uh I think this is I dare. I think it is. <clears throat> so you have uh, a, a different battalion of Nazis with the Ukrainian flag. She does not see this. Okay. She does not see this. She's look, they don't have it. They don't have this on the front of their uniforms, guys. Okay. They have it on the side of their sleeves. They don't put this on the front of their uniform. So she doesn't know. It's for you, not no and then she goes no for you for the russian world for putin this is what she says to him so he takes so he gives her the food he says hold this he gives her the bag and he takes her flag and then when he takes her flag, he goes, Slava Ukraine. And her face changes. She goes from happy to confusion. And then she realized, uh-oh, these are not Russians. These are legitimate Ukraine Nazis. <laughs> Look, she's confused. He takes her flag, he throws it on the ground, and he steps on it. And that's when she, and I think he shows his sleeve, and that's when she realized, uh-oh, this is a Ukraine Nazi. So he's stepping on the flag. Look at how now she realized, uh oh, I messed up. This, this so you see he's showing the patch. He's showing he is not Russian. He is from Ukraine. <laughs> Stepping on the flag. Stepping on this elder woman's flag. And y'all want to know why Russia is there in Ukraine? Because they've been torturing these people for eight years. So she gets the food, she puts it gently back in the bag. And she says, keep it. I don't want it. Well, they say keep it. And she says, I don't want it. This woman is hungry. They don't, listen, they don't have access to the grocery store. They don't have access to a lot of places. They can only live off the, off the little bit of the land <clears throat> and their animals provide them, right? And even though she needs the food, she gives it back because how he disrespected her flag and her, and her country. She says, I don't want it. And she gives it back to him. My parents died for this flag and you're stepping on it. I, the fact that she, she is saying this to Nazis is the reason why she's glorified. She doesn't have a weapon. Her and her husband can't defend themselves against these Ukrainian Nazis. They can't do that. And she looks at this Russian says, my parents died for this flag and you're stepping on it. I'm stepping on it. This is what the Ukraine Nazi is saying. I'm stepping on it because they came to my home. I'm speaking Russian to you right now. I fight for my land. 
I want you guys to understand you really need to do some research in what's been going on for the last eight years in the Donbass, in Mariupol, okay, in Kharkov, in a lot of these places. They have been trying to exterminate the Ukraines, the ones we've been sending $50 billion to, have been trying to cleanse their country of Russians. So you mean to tell me that our country can be the country that can let everybody in here? But you, we're going to sit up here and give all this money to a country that's not in NATO, that's not part of the EU, that we don't use for major trading. We don't need Ukraine. And you mean to tell me we have funded these people to kill off Russians? Really? Is that what we're doing now? They've been dealing with this for eight years. Eight years. And when I tell you Russia's been too nice, they have been too nice. Had these people sign two agreements, the Minsk agreement, two of them. They didn't even, they didn't even abide by the own agreement that they signed. We have been under this illusion that Russia is zero, zero. I wish, I wish Russia was zero tolerance. I wish they, to me, and I'm saying this as an American, they are too nice. They are too freaking patient. I would have, if I was Russia, I would have handled these people back in 2014. So they cut off the part. The, the end to this video, because a Ukrainian Nazi did this, he recorded this video. So let me tell you about the end of this video, because the end of the video is on Telegram, and I don't know how to uh, to uh, upload videos, or excuse me, download videos from Telegram. So they cut the video off where she, he, she, after he says this to her, she reach over and says, give me back my flag. And he takes it up and says, no, and they walk away with the food. So because of this, right, because of this, uh, Babushka, uh, Babushka is celebrated. She's an icon. Z, her name, they call her Babushka Z. So they've been celebrating her, right? They've been celebrating her like this. Put in, putting her all over her and her husband. You know what I'm saying? They, this is a, they've been making a, a murals of her. They have uh, been making um, statues of her, paintings of her. You know, um, they even have, ta they even, these men are even tattooing themselves uh, of, uh, of her. She doesn't know she's an icon. She has no idea that she's an icon. Okay. She has no idea. Right. Okay. So here's what happens. She becomes this, this, uh, she's becoming this, this icon and this motivation because all of the, all of the Western world is becoming anti-Russian, Russian phobia. They are taking Russians money. They are evicting them out of their homes. They are banishing them from the, they are taking their money out of the banks. They're doing a lot of fucked up things to Russia and Russians right now. Excuse me, let me just say the Russians. So they are using this as a symbol, like even this hungry elder women in the face of three Ukrainian Nazis is still saying, my parents died for that flag you're stepping on. And she gave them back their food, even though they're hungry. They're hungry. So here's what happened, right? They become an icon. I'm, I'm just going to let the video play. And I'm not going to, um, I'm not going to, uh, it, cause nobody did a translation on this video. So the same Ukrainian Nazis come back to their home and says, it's pretty dangerous out of here. Look what's happening to your homes. Look at how they destroying all these homes around here. We want to take you to safety. Now, Babushka Z and her husband know that they ain't crazy. They like, oh no, we, 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 they, they, she saw, they saw what they did to the flag. They saw what they did, uh, what they said in reference to, you know, 
the Russia and this, and they know that if they go with these Ukrainian Nazis, that there's a strong chance that they are going to kill them. Yes, they have been bombing all of these homes in Kharkov, but uh, but for some reason they're like, okay, we're gonna spare you guys, so we're gonna save you, so we're gonna we're gonna have you evacuate. So they say, no, no, we don't want to leave because we want to take care of our animals. We want to take care of our animals. We don't. We don't want to leave our animals. So they're still trying to talk to talk to them. It's like, oh well, you're gonna die. The Russian. They're like, this is what they're, they're. The Russians are gonna. The Russians are bombing you. The Russians are doing this to you. The Russians are doing that to you. The Russians are the ones who are doing all this to you. Blah blah blah. So we're trying to save you. This we're trying to save all of you. And she's like, I don't understand why. She never says Russia. She's like, why do they have to do this to our our neighborhood? So anyway, she eventually leaves yeah she eventually leaves because she don't want no parts of this let me see when she starts walking away right here she starts leaving because she knows all right she knows that they are in danger so she leaves and so the husband he doesn't have his glasses on this time the husband stays behind and they try to convince the husband to evacuate with them. And they're like, no, we're going to stay. And so, and the, 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 the husband is blessing them because <laughs> the husband is very, very religious. Okay. Um, I don't know everything that's being said. I wish somebody would translate this video the way they translated this other video, but the husband is super, super, super religious. He's blessing these evil Nazis, these evil, evil Nazis and praying for them. Got his cross in his pants. He's, he's doing this to protect themselves. Right. All right. And so they got a bunch of dogs. They got a bunch of chickens. They got some places where they can basically take care of themselves. All right. So they got the name of of her her name is anna ivonova all right uh a old woman who has become a famous pro-russian war icon and now they have forced her to move from her home and village in kharkiv uh they tried to make her revoke what she said and lie and uh lie to her that her house has been destroyed so we already seen this part so uh, hold on, I guess you can, see. you already seen this guy, so, so this is what they've been, um, right here. So a, so this person went to the house and no one's there. So before I show you the rest, okay, the dogs, okay, yeah, never mind. So the dogs are abandoned. So I don't know what they, what happened with the dogs. So those are the dogs from earlier. Okay. So the fuckers kidnapped them. They came there the third time and they took them. And they made them read that they rebuke Putin, that they disavow Russia. And look at the motherfucker points to his, look at how he takes his arm to show you. Yeah, we got him. We got, we got your babushkas. We got your babushka. We got, we got your grandma and your grandpa. Now, why am I doing a story about this? So here's them. Uh, here's where they inside. I don't know where they are, but here's where both of them are. And they're talking to them. So I guess I don't know. Like I said, what's so what's so frustrating? And the reason why this doesn't spread on America is because I don't understand. Like you guys, I, I know we're we're Americans, we're spoiled. But I'm telling you guys, if you if Russia, if you guys want r people in America to take these things and make it spread, you gotta put subtitles to it. I don't speak Russian. I don't know what's being said here. 
But people are telling me that the Russians behind the camera are telling her to disavow Putin and disavow Russia. I don't know if she's saying it or not. I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't know what they're saying. Oh, and they lied and said that their house is destroyed, which is not true. They said Russia destroyed your home. Okay. So, guess what dumb motherfuckers are doing? They're saying that this is not Babushka Z and this is not her husband. These are fakes. Now, what is amazing is that the world is filled with retarded people. And I understand that when you're borderline retarded and there's so much fake news out there, that you're going, well, maybe I need some confirmation if they are really Babushka. So let me tell you, because I am smarter than most people, not only does her nose is the same of Barbushka. Hold on a second. Because we remember now. Remember, they're saying that this is not the same woman. So when I, when I analyze people, right? When I analyze people, okay? When I analyze people, I look at the cheeks. I look at the jawline because she got her hair covered. And I look at the nose. But before I even go to the face, before I even go to the face, I went to go look at the common body of a babushka. And I'm not trying to be mean here, but every babushka I have seen has been a round babushka. This has been like the grandmas I have seen from Russia have never been tiny and short. Okay, I have never, yeah, that's, that's, uh, this is, uh, Rocky, Rocky decided, uh, what's his name, uh, ASAP Rocky, dumbass, ASAP Rocky thought that, uh, is trying to put out a, a I, had, I had no idea that the Bushka was a fucking style for Negroes, okay, <laughs> I don't, I had no idea that, that they were doing this, so y'all gonna see black men, try to pass off the barbushka but anyway when i see barbushka i see barbushkas like this you know what I'm saying that that are like nice and nice and round and you know what I'm saying they they nice and plump and everything like that i ne i this is the first you see what i'm saying let's look at this hold on a second let's actually look look at look at this i this is a woman I never see a skinny short, but by the way, they're all short probably, but they're well fed. They're nice round babushkas. They're nice round grandmas, right? So when I saw this tiny woman, I'm like, that woman is tiny. <laughs> so please explain to me, how do you find a short, tiny grandma with this type of nose same nose nose here same nose here same nose here oh let's look at her jawline she got high cheek jump she got high cheeks look high cheekbones here high cheekbones here high cheekbones here her cheeks her cheeks stand out more than the bottom part of her jaw and then when you look at her chin okay Look at the chin, right? Which is more pronounced here because she got it covered up with her her head, her her babushka head wrap here. Okay, not so much here because she got it on the back of her. But this is this is a very good uh, um, this is a very good um, high high definition camera. 
but also so 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 there you go you gotta show you you trying to tell me that there's a doppelganger a dop, doppel ah oh, doppelganger thank you doppelganger okay oh babushka means scarf okay so you mean to tell me that you're gonna have another doppelganger of this woman right here <laughs> okay okay so let's say for instance okay guys well we could play the dumb we could play the retard game we can we can play the retard game okay so let's say for instance okay you got this tiny malnourished woman right here okay so explain to me how you find the same freaking man in here now by the way he got his glasses on in here but he don't have his glasses on here Look at the beard. Look at the beard. You mean to tell me you're gonna find a same freaking man that has a, a, a light, what is this? A light sandy blonde beard going down here and white on the side? You're gonna sign to find the same one and say that this is a fake? These people are lying to you. And it's like, I what what is so frustrating for me? What is so frustrating for me is that people are believing that this is a fake. People from Ukraine, Russia, and America. These retarded people are like, oh, that's a fake. That's a fake. That's a fake. That, 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 that's not the real babushka. That's not the real babushka. That's not real her and her, her old husband. So because the world is filled with retards, right? This is what I said. Okay. Okay, if you believe these Nazis don't really have the real babushka and her husband, okay? If you really, if you believe, if that's true, then where is the evidence of the real ones? Go to the same house, go to the same house that's here in this picture and that's here in this picture, okay? Let me see if they show it. They're going to show it. Probably when she's leaving. Yeah, let's go to the same house and get them and show them okay the same house here show me show me where they at show me where they at if you're saying that these two are fake then go to the house and show me the real ones that are there oh you can't because they are actually in the custody of ukraine nazis um oh my god you're right i didn't even oh my goodness you're right he got the same jacket on he has the same jacket thank you yakasama thank you yakasama i didn't even i'm too busy looking at his face i'm too busy looking at his beard and i'm like Oh my God, yeah, he got the same jacket on. Listen, cause I'm gonna end this, all right, and then get onto the news. I just wanted to make a video and upload it to this channel. Just bringing, bringing awareness. By the way, my channel is demonetized. So therefore this message is not gonna get out there like I want it to. So if anybody wanna take you, this is gonna be the first time you take a video of mine and actually share it. You know what I'm saying? I would love to be wrong about this, but I'm not. I can, I can look at their faces and tell that it's the same older people. And, and also here's, here's my challenge to Russia. You guys got good facial recognition uh, technology that you have gotten from China. If these are not the same elders that were in the original video, if these are not the same elders, then make a statement saying you won't because you know that the Nazis got them. You know that the Nazis got them. You know they do. You know that the Nazis got them. And I think that the same people who sit up here and lied about Gonzalo Lara being dead and that they saw his dead body and they witnessed him uh, getting tortured. These are the same fuckers who are saying, oh, oh, uh, this is fake news. Uh, the Nazis don't have them. This is fake news. 
And I'm attached to elders. I, you know, if it wasn't for the fact that this woman had the balls to say, I don't want your food. I know I'm hungry. My husband is hungry, but you stepped on the flag that my parents died for. I don't want your food. And I'm going to stand up to you, even though you're the ones with rifles. That is a woman with guts. But I don't know. I'm so afraid. I'm so afraid for these two. And I'm just going to say this. Don't put it past Nazis to do something very bad. And I hope it, I swear, I hope it doesn't happen. You have seen them do some foul things. Why, why would you think that this would not be beneath them? Hey, everybody, this is Tree from treeoflogic.com. Listen, I want you to go to my website, treeoflogic.com, and I want you to bookmark it right now. Stop what you're doing. Go to www.treeoflogic.com for you boomers and treeoflogic.com for everybody else. And I want you to favor it and bookmark it. That is where you're going to find all my content. You're going to find my schedule. You're going to find out what I'm doing, what's happening, what's what I'm up to. And you're going to also find other trinkets of what uh, of, about my content. So if you don't see me on YouTube for a couple of days or three days gone by and you don't see any YouTube videos, you need to go to treeoflogic.com, go to the news and update section, and there it will tell you what's going on, what happened, and where you can find my content. So remember, this is my main platform, treeoflogic.com, not YouTube. Treeoflogic.com is my main platform. Go there right now, bookmark it, and don't forget, that's where you can find all the information in reference to me.